So if you just saw this video and you want to have that theme for yourself, I'm about to show you a tutorial on how to get it on Dolphin Emulator, but you will need some stuff before we begin this tutorial. So the first thing that you're going to need is the Dolphin Emulator with a main menu and homebrew installed. You will also need a virtual SD card. You're going to need these is because the main menu of course is if you want to load the main menu homebrew is needed because you need to load the my menu file application which you will also need to load the menu another thing you're going to need is the i'm disk driver application this treats the virtual sd card as if it's a real sd card that you can load into your wii and finally, the last thing that you're going to need is an IQ because this isn't the easiest thing in the world, but it's not always the hardest. So without further ado, let's begin this tutorial. So first off, what you're going to want to do to insert the theme is you want to open up your files. And you want to go to wherever Dolphin is stored. So see, I have mine stored in Documents. I open this up and I go to Wii. And then see this SD RAW? You should have this right here. If you have a virtual SD card, you're going to click on it once. Left click and then right click. You want to press Mount with I'm Disk, Virtual Disk. Then you're going to see this. First of all, we want to always put removable media. Um, 
it will not work if you don't put this, so make sure to check this right here. And then you can switch the drive letter to whatever you want. I like E. It's a good letter. Press OK. Now you're going to want to exit out of File Explorer now. You're going to want to go back into it to refresh it completely, and then you'll see your removable disk. So once you have everything you need, you have the SD card, you have the My Menu Fi, and you have the folder called Mod Themes, and you have Homebrew and everything like that. You're going to want to click in Mod Themes. I already have some already. And then you see the download for the theme. You're going to you're going to cut or copy or whatever you want to do. I can just drag it in here. It will work. And so now we can we can eject this. Eject. And then we're going to right click it again. Unmount I'm disk virtual disk. It's going to pop up this message, but don't worry, you're doing everything correctly. So we can exit out of this now. Open up Dolphin. We can now go to Tools and Load Wii Menu. Now you're going to see I already have it inserted. Um, but yours will still be the regular menu, or whatever your menu is. So, now we go to our homebrew channel. We can press start. That purple screen is normal. If you already have homebrew, you should know that. And you can click My Menufy. Then you can load it. Then you can just left click or however you use your controller, press A again or left click again. Then using the arrow keys on your PC or if you have um, a different controller, you can go down, up and down. For PC, you can now left click again. It should install all of it. And it should restart. And then the theme should load. Everything should be working. Well, I hope you enjoy this theme. And consider liking and subscribing because it doesn't hurt anything. And it's a great way to spread my channel to others who may not know about this. Anyways, thank you for letting me waste your day.